Yeah. Okay, what about a nice laugh, Archie? Can you laugh? And then what about a nice big kiss for everybody? Oh. Well, nice kiss there from Archie. As I said, it's not just Santa there to copy. They can also copy some actions as well. If we take a look at Bobby Jake and Archie, they're all going to demonstrate an action they've learned to copy off another of Longley's residents. Can anybody guess who they're pretending to be? They're pretending to be Egyptian fruit bats. That's right. So well done, Archie. Well done, Jake. And well done, Bobby. And then if we go back to Matilda, who's a very competitive bird, she likes to turn everything into the competition. So let's see who's louder. All of you guys versus this one parrot. So if you can, put me all together, give me a nice half whistle. That was a scream. We need whistles. Okay, a few people loud, loud is a crucial element here, mum. Okay, right, Matilda, there's quite a few loud ones in that. Can you beat that? Nice half whistles. Pretty loud all on her own, and just like Bobby and Jake, Matilda's also got her own animal impression that she likes to do. Matilda, can you do your impression for me nice and loud? Do again nice and loud? Quack, quack. So she's pretending to be. Now going back to talk about her dragon accent, but as I said, she has got two toes that point forward and two toes that point backwards. So if we get her to demonstrate just how good she is on those feet, Matilda has her very own pair of parrot on the street to help me. She's going to get her skates on and just going to take what a good grip those side and that's going to be give her. Good thing. Uh, and so off we go. Uh, well, you're now is the time to use them because he is going to stop and pose for you all just as soon as he gets going. Go on, off we go then, Jake. You're going to get on the scooter. Whenever you're ready, that's it, off we go. Right, oh, I'm going to pose there. The first one sees pushing himself along with those side of axle feet and keeping a nice pocket on those handlebars with that very, very strong feet. Another pose. That's it. Let's give a bit of a pose on that. Jake's nice feet on those feet. Well done. It's a very strong beat that he's got. Uh, they can use it to break their way into tough seats and nuts, but when they want to, they can be quite gentle with it. If we go to Archie next, Archie's quite a sporty parrot. He likes to play basketball, but his basketball is made of plastic. If he applied all the pressure of his feet to this basketball, he would break it and he wouldn't be able to play anymore. So hopefully, we're not going to chew it like we did the last one, are we, Let's just get me. Go and throw it. Really there. I Well done, but it's not just... Now, Bobby's a bit more shy than the other parrots. He does need a little bit of encouragement because he can cheer and clap as he makes his way down the table. And he'll certainly won't lose hope. Yes, that's it. Off we go then, Bobby. Not only is this great fun for him, but it's also great enrichment and good exercise, helping to keep his mind and body active. Absolutely there. So you're going to score a goal. Yeah. 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 Right, Matilda. Four bearings, ready? Four. Go! Matilda. Four to play bearings. Ready? One, two, three, four. Ready? Ready? Go! There we go. How about another two, five, and ten? Six. There's a six. Right, Matilda. Six this time. Ready? Ready? Six. Ready? Go! Tell her the answer this time. It's quite easy to get an answer this time. Matilda, here at six plus four. Six plus four, ready? Ready? You got it? Ready? Go! Hang on, no, start again. Nice clear bell ring. So have a drop, I didn't get it wrong. Six plus four, ready? Go! That's it. That's it. That's it. Now all of these parrots come from the tropical rainforest of South America, which as we all know is under threat from things like deforestation. And there are lots of things that we can do in our own daily routine to help lessen our own 